So, hi, uh, Mr. Giles here. Um, I'm, I'm putting this little intro on a video on songwriting. This is not a, an assignment from my class, um, but I do a lot of how-tos on this channel. And I think a lot of people uh, look at songwriting as something that is impossible to do. Um, they just don't know where to start. And I'm reading a really good book called How to Write One Song by Jeff Tweedy. And if I've learned anything from it, uh, so far it's anyone can do it and there is a process for it and it starts many times it starts with words you can start with music too but if you've never done any of that maybe you don't even play an instrument here's a way to get started writing a song so the video that follows is just a uh, it's under five minutes uh, explanation of how to get started writing one song you could do it you can write one song. Jeff Tweedy, songwriting exercise number one uh, from his book, How to Write One Song. I love this. It's a way to kickstart your writing. You should get the book, uh, Jeff Tweedy's How to Write One Song. Step one, make a list of 10, 15 words uh, that you would associate with something. And we're looking for verbs. So start with verbs. So let's say 10 things that a basketball player would do. Okay, I'm gonna pause and you write down 10 things a basketball player would do. I'll demonstrate. All right, 10 things a basketball player would do. Run, shoot, sweat. So there's my 10 words. Now look around your room and write down objects that you see in the room. You have 10 words, write down 10 objects. Tape, book, mic, your list of 10 objects that you can see around you. Connect the list from here to here uh, to ones that maybe wouldn't normally connect. So let's see, the tape, the tape sweating, pillow blocking, the mug yelling, shoes passing, there you go. You make a bunch of connections. Now comes the bad poetry section. Really quick, write like a free form poem using some of the more interesting words to you. Choose five or six, choose all 10, whatever. See what I come up with. Okay, now that I've got words and phrases to work with, and I can always jump back in and pull any of the other words that I had that I thought were cool, um, I'm gonna try to write some lines that actually rhyme. And I think I had an accidental rhyme with tape and face, but I'm gonna just work on now making some of these words have a rhyme scheme. So in this process, you can change anything. So you can put a new word, you can put new verbs, uh, you can go grab one you didn't use. There's no, there's no rule for when you start writing the lyric. Um, but if you liked everything you had, you know, use it. But if, if uh, you think of something new from just reading this, uh, do that. But so you can already see, but I'm, I'm, line, I'm rhyming every other line. So I'm doing this, the second and fourth lines. So for this, this particular song, that's what I'm gonna do. So I have myself a verse and maybe a chorus or a verse and another part. So kind of excited. Um, and that only took, really, that only took me five, five minutes total to do that. Don't judge it too much. Just write it. Don't overthink it. Don't spend too much time correcting each line or syllable or making sure the rhyme scheme is perfect. You can edit that later, or maybe not. You know, maybe leave it as it is. And that's how you start a song. So that's exercise one from Jeff Tweedy's how to write one song and you start writing one song by writing one word and combining that word with another word and then writing a sentence and then putting some of those sentences one after another pretty soon you've got a verse or a chorus or a bridge or something start a song so hope that's helpful hope that got you started thank you Jeff Tweedy uh, one for the songs you write and for this book that helps explore your creative process